the Alto's a 97, the Cappuccino's a 92. I got into them from seeing them online and stuff. I just okay. wanted this quirky little small thing with a little three-cylinder. So the Alto has a slightly newer version engine than the Cap. This one's a three-cylinder turbo. They're, they're 660 cc's. So pretty small. This one is all-wheel drive too though. And since I got this one, it just it's snowballed really hard. Because I wanted the I wanted the Alta Works first, and then I found out about the Cappuccinos. But I had a chance to get this one fairly. I was I traded for it. Now this one's a front engine rear wheel drive. Okay. Cool. So it was like the kind of like the sporty version of a K car. You can bump the power up on the stock motors quite a bit. You can get them up to about 150 horse on stock internals. And some people put just put just upgraded pistons and they bring them up to 180. But they also makes better low down torque where the Cappuccino's engine has better high high end power. And they they both rev over 9,000. So let's see what the front of the hood of this thing looks like. And this is a convertible hardtop, right? Yeah. It's a small three piece. Three piece? Oh, okay. So it's mostly stock, I just have an upgraded monster support intercooler, some hard pipes and then just an air filter. But I've done a bunch of internal stuff. I got a monster support head gasket, multi steel one, a bunch of gasket refreshes and it has a bigger turbo. I just haven't, I'm waiting on getting a standalone ECU to bump the boost up farther. Here's a question, did you drive it back from Vancouver or truck? We drove the Alto down. Yeah. To pick this up. And that we, when we first picked it up from Vancouver, we figured out that the top can only go in the trunk a certain way or it won't fit. Oh, it has like no key on it. It's really, it's actually kind of com it's really comfortable. Yeah. Like, it's, like a, like it's a cappuccino. It's a cappuccino. <laughs> I love this car. Thank you so much to everybody who attended Wheaton Honda's inaugural tuner night. This is something we're going to do again. It's been a great success. Please reach us to us Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Like the photos. Share anything you took tonight. We'd love to see it and share it with everybody else. Also want to shout a big thanks to all the tuner clubs who came out tonight and supported us. It's been phenomenal. We raised a lot of money for United Way. And look forward to seeing you all next time.